I just got a message from my assistant, too, that a package has arrived for me. So I'm going to head downstairs, head down to my office, go see what that is. I have an idea of what it is, but you don't know. This could be my first ever unboxing video on YouTube. So why don't you join me and let's go check it out. Excited to see what this package is. Pon Pon is very excited, as you can see. Pon, you excited? Hi. Hi, guys. I'm here to get my package. Yes. Do you here mind you being on camera? I'm gonna do a little vlog about it, okay. like an unboxing. All right. We don't know what it is, even though I know what it is. Thank you, too. Here you go. <laughs> All right. All right, I got my package here, mask off because I'm back in the house. I'm going to set up my little thing here. But here's your box. What do we have here? What do we have here? Hmm. We got two bags here. This should be the Wotencraft travel pilot bag. This should be the medium here. Looks about right. And this should be the small version, both in this brand new color that's new to Wotencraft. This is a khaki brown color. Very cool. And this is their new Cordura canvas, which is supposed to be half the weight. And right off the bat, I can tell you it feels half the weight. These are a lot lighter than their normal bags. There's one thing that I would say, one complaint about their old bags was they were just a little bit heavy for my liking. But let's open these bags up and see what's inside because there should be the modular system inside here that goes on the outside of these bags. They told me to send me a couple of those to test out as well. So let's get these open. So I've never really done one of these unboxings before. This is the first time. Wotencraft does sponsor me. I'll put that out there right away. I did ask for these bags because I do like the color. Uh, they send me bags, but they don't make me review it. They don't actually tell me to like, oh, you should you know, give a review in exchange. They just send me bags. That's our sponsorship deal. They send me bags. I never used to do reviews in their bags. I just started doing it now. So that's not really, that's not really how our relationship works. They actually just give me bags. I test them out and give them feedback. Um, so, okay, what we have here are, I did request these bags because I was very excited about this brand new color. This is a color that I've been hoping that Wotencraft would produce for a long time. Really light tan, it's, it's a darker brown color here. Uh, but I really dig it, I really like this look a lot. So I'll go through these two quickly. I'm not gonna do a full review because they're, they're brand new bags. I, don't have a, I haven't got a chance to test them, but this is the pilot bag in small and this is the pilot bag in medium. So I don't know if they'll come out with a large or not, but this is a brand new material for them. You can feel it, you can't feel it, but I can feel it. Then it's half the weight. You can tell right away, these bags are very, very light. These are camera bags, but they also work as like an everyday carry bag or a messenger bag. This one you could throw a laptop, this one you could throw a small laptop in you know, or, or a tablet or something like that. So let's go, just go through these quickly. This, this is their new modular system here. You see these little bits in front. This is meant for attaching. So they did tell me they'd include some modular setup here. Yeah, here they are here. So you, these are sold separately. They do come with their own little strap. Modular system here, they gave me a few of these for free included in. These are sold separately. They don't come with the kit. So if you do want these, you have to buy them separately. But they attach on right in the front here. I've never done this before, but they've got these little clips here. I'll show you here and they just sort of snap on. The clips are plastic. I would, I would have liked metal in this situation, but you know, that's okay. I know they're trying to save weight. This is a lightweight bag and I do appreciate it. So they gave me these two setups here. This one, you could hold a lens in here. You could hold a water ball in here or just like pack some extra accessories in here. This one here is, has a mesh pocket in front, which is quite nice and a zipper in here. So you could keep memory cards and batteries and stuff like that. This is really cool. Very new system, very new very new system, something modular, something they're going with. You know, they've got these little straps here. So the way this attaches is fairly simple. So the, uh, these latches here, you, you just basically put them on the front there. <coughs> and you stick them through there and 
there you go. And you can make your bag modular, which is really cool because like sometimes I wanna carry a lot of stuff, sometimes I don't need to carry a lot of stuff. Modular system. So these go on the front, you can take them off, take them on, you can wear them on their own if you'd like. I'm just gonna take them off for now just so I can go through the bag, but these also fit, see that though, very quick, the way they come on and off. Super quick, very cool, and they fit on the small bag as well. We've got the normal inserts that most camera bags here, the sort of modular system with Velcro that you can snap and move around. Put the small one over here for now just to go through this, and again, I'm just gonna go through the medium size today because they do have the same feature. So a new locking mechanism here, which is just a very, very simple clip here. This actually is made out of metal here. This very quick access just snaps right there. It doesn't really snap, it just sort of latches. So you just sort of take it here, and if you want to undo your bag, so quick and easy access. Not a full zip pocket, which some people like because of theft. I don't like it because I like to be able to get in and out. They use all YKK zippers. One of these little straps here for if you want to put it on your roller bag or something like that, or just another place to grab, but it does have your normal grip here, which I like. All these little straps here, you could attach carabiners and add other accessories here. It's bottom adjustable strap here if you wanted to put a tripod in there or something like that. So inside, you've got a separator for your laptop or your tablet. I'm loving this material. Very, very cool, this canvas here. Really digging the color, digging the new look, and really loving this modular system. So let's see, for pockets, you've got your front pocket here, which does inside have these other little mesh pockets here so you could load stuff in there. So you've got your main zipper pocket in front, you've got your weather sealed zipper pocket in the back, and then you've got these other little side things here, these sort of elastic side pockets on both sides, so if you wanna throw some stuff in there and you tipped it upside down, it wouldn't come out. For the most part, it, you know, unless it was really tiny or some coins wouldn't fit in there, but you could put a water bottle in there, another little small camera if you wanted. You could even stick a lens in there, but you'd have to be careful because you wouldn't want it to bang up on anything. And then, like, they've been into this whole little secret pocket thing. So if you look, shh, again, if you look, you've got this little secret pocket in here. Like, look, my hand comes through here. That's kind of cool. I'm really digging this bag. And then also this space in here. Can you see? Can I go through? Can you see my eyes? Maybe not, but you're, you can see my hand can come through. You could stick like a jacket in here, a raincoat or something like that. But even inside, it's got these little zippered, a little zippered mesh pocket that you can access for both sides. And you could stick some, I don't know, if you wanted to put like your passport in here or some money in there, no one even know that pocket exists. Well, now you know, because I told you. But, but it's got a really, I love their little secret pocket thing. I like what they're doing with that. But folds over nicely here, it'll just rest, it'll sit nicely like that. Simple latch to get in and out. Like I said before, I'm gonna test this out. But right now, just pretty simple to add in, adjustable there. Here, small is basically the same thing. Small still has the hidden pocket here, the little secret pocket. It's got the weather sealed pocket in the back. It's got the little thing here for your roller bag. It also has a removable strap here. Again, I don't like the plastic here. I'm not really into that. I do wish this was metal. Okay, just to give you an idea of what the bags look like on a human, because I always feel like that's missing from these reviews of bags. Like, what do they look like compared to a person? I like to see how big they are. It's always tough to tell the scale. So I'm about 6'1", about 230 pounds. Yeah, I know, I could lose some weight. So this is the medium bag here. So you can just sort of see how it sits. I could probably adjust it a little bit better, but rest on your back here if you want, your hip. Quite flexible here, the way it sort of wraps around your torso. I like that it wraps around your hip. Uh, so you get a feel for here. This is the medium. This is the small here. You can see significantly smaller here. This rest here, I probably could make it a little bit longer here. Everything is adjustable on these. So this is what it looks like from the side. So it looks like from the front, if you want it to work in and out of it. This is what it looks like from the back. And here is the accessory pouch. So you see these pouches again, remember they can clip on front if you want here, or you can take them with their own strap and wear them separately. Now this is what I find coolest thing about this system. This is what I'm most excited about because some days I'm changing my kit up, some days I'm changing what I'm taking out. So if I went away for assignment for like a week, maybe in the morning I'm taking my full bag out, my full kit. Maybe in the afternoon I just wanna go out with something more simple. Just having this over my shoulder or slung around my chest and I could stick another lens in here because honestly like I like going out with a 35 and one camera but having another battery with me just in case, another memory card just in case, and then another focal length just in case so I could shove my 75 in here, feel pretty good about it. And if, you know, it, it's not super padded, but it's enough. But if you really wanted that extra comfort, you could wrap something around it. So that's the use for me. That's what I'm most excited about this system. Dislikes were, I don't like the, I don't like the plastic clamps here. I don't like anything plastic on my bags, but it's not a deal breaker for me. I can live with that. I get why they did it. They're going with a more lightweight system and that's what this bag is all about. What I love about it is the new color. I really dig this. This khaki brown color and what I'm most excited about what I'm really really excited about 
is this modular system. I'm so excited to use this. I'm so excited to test it. And once I do test it, once I take it out in the field, I will do a follow-up review about these bags once I really, really put them to use. That's just my first impressions, my initial thoughts on this bag. Thank you guys for tuning in. If you want more details about these bags, pricing, specs, and all that kind of stuff, I'll put a link in the description box. But for now, that's it, guys. Thank you for tuning in again. This is the Wotencraft Pilot Bag in size medium and size small with the modular system that is sold separately. Thank you guys for tuning in. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and have a great day.